Hey guys, welcome to a special Pokemon card video. In this one, I've got a complete Vivid Voltage Master Set, and this is from the Sword and Shield era. It features the Pikachu VMAX, a couple of other Pokemon, and it's the first set that introduces amazing rare cards, which is like a little special textured card. Really cool looking cards. Let's jump straight into the master set. I'll show you what's in there and I uh, will go towards the secret rares and I'll tell you what the last card was I needed to finish this set. Um, this set was really cool when it came out. A lot of people were jumping on the bandwagon to get the build and battle kits. You can see we have the amazing rare Celebi there, with the paint flecked pattern. It's all textured, really cool cards. Um, people were on the bandwagon to get the uh, build and battle kits for this set. Um, there was Charizard and Lugia promos in there and a Snorlax. And they were getting quite expensive. It got to a point where you could um, buy these build and battle kits from the shop for about 40 Australian dollars. And uh, open them up, get a Charizard, sell it for 200 There's that Charizard card. Um, there's a build and battle promo for it. Uh, it got to a point where you could sell the Charizard for 200 bucks or just buy the boxes for um, 40 bucks and sell them by the end of the day for like 60 or 80 and make a profit just from buying it from the shop. It was pretty nuts. Uh, those sealed cases of those are going for about 800 Australian dollars now. So they're about $80 each for the, uh, the case of sealed build and battle kits. There's a Zacian, amazing rare. A couple of really nice artworks for the uh, Amazing Rares in this set. I really like the including them into this. So Colossal VMAX, another Zamazenda Amazing Rare. Got a Drapion V, different to the one that came out in the most recent uh, Lost Origins set. This set took me quite a long time to finish. That's Jirachi Amazing Rare. And the reason for that is because the last card I wanted to get I couldn't find one cheap enough that I wanted to pay for. All of them were just way too overpriced. That's the uh, Snorlax. Really nice card, the Gormandise one. People seem to be using that in the uh, the TCG game. There's Lugia, love that Pokemon. I've got some uh, amazing rare Rayquaza. Really love that design. It's a Togekiss Pokemon. Some trainer cards. We're introduced here to the Leon Trainer Card Hollow. Uh, memory Capsule sees a fair bit of play. You can use the telescopic sight in your um, decks that hit bench Pokemon. And got some special energy. And here we go, the Full Arts. Let's just go through all of these. Ore Beetle, Sarude, Talonflame, Germanitan, Pikachu V. Ampharos, Alakazam, which doesn't get a card in this set. You can only get the full art in this set. The, the normal Alakazam came as a box promo. Colossal V full art. There's our Surfetched, Drapion full art. Steelix, Aegislash, Togekiss, some trainers. We've got Alistar, B, Beauty, Leon, Nessa, this was uh, an expensive one to get for this set. Opal and Pokemon Center Lady. And the Rainbow Rare. So the missing spot here is the Rainbow Rare Pikachu VMAX, which I keep in this hard case. I'm not going to put it in the book just yet. And this was the last card I needed for the set. So I picked this up for $15. But it took me a while to find one that cheap. Most of the ones I saw online were going for about like... 30 to 40 dollars each and I didn't want to pay overpriced for it. I know it's only about 15 dollar card So it's the uh, Pikachu V Max again Beautiful card here very expensive sitting about 300 and something dollars at the moment Very good condition this one too. Let's keep it safe in the uh, the case Germanitan Colossal Aegis Slash Togekiss Rainbows some rainbow trainers and the gold cards of this set, there's a Obstagoon and a Ranguru. And these gold cards are actually shiny. So in the more recent sets, when we got our gold cards, uh, the V-Stars and Vs or so, we actually didn't get any shiny ones. 
which is a bit disappointing. They just kept them as like the normal color. And we get some trainer gold cards, Cape of Toughness, Heroes Medal, Memory Capsule, and Telescopic Sight. And then I like to keep booster pack art of each of the packs. So that's the Ore Beetle one. It's an interesting uh, deck, that one. It saw a bit of play when it came out, but still you don't see him so much anymore. And then we have the art for the Celebi. You can sort of see a paint fleck pattern around it, similar to the Amazing Rare in this set. Really cool card, that one. Uh, as a Rude V, um, our artwork for this pack actually has a really good attack. I'm surprised it doesn't see much play as it should. And of course, the Pikachu booster pack. So these are just empty packets. I like to keep one of each just for this master set. So that is my complete Vivid Voltage master set. Uh, of course, the Pikachu VMAX goes in that spot. If you guys like these videos, make sure you leave a like and subscribe down here. And uh, I'll upload some more pack opening videos soon. Hopefully I'll finish some more sets and upload those as well. I uh, hope you guys, yeah, enjoy this. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace out, guys. See you then.